Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. From what we have here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 9 is to power x equals to log 90 from here. That is, next step here, we apply the power of log. When we have log m raised to power p, the same thing as p log m. That is here, this becomes x log 9 equals to log 90 from here. The next step here, divide both sides by log 9. Divide this side by log 9. Also, divide this side by log 9, which implies here, log 9 cancel each other. We have x equals to log 90 over log 9. Then, next step here, we can rewrite 90 as 9 times 10, which implies, oh yeah, becomes x equals to log 9 times 10 over log 9. And this follows the law of log when well, we have log a times b. This is the same thing as log a plus log b. That is, what we have here becomes x equals to log 9 plus log 10 over log 9. Then, next step here, we separate this into two fractions, and we have x equals to log 9 over log 9 plus log 10 over log 9, which implies here, log 9 cancel each other, we have one left, that is x equals to 1 plus log 10 over log 9. Then, next step here, also 10 can be expressed as 2 times 5. And what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 times 5 over log 9. Then, this also follows the law of logarithm. And this becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 plus log 5 over log 9. Then from here, we separate this into two fractions. And we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 9 plus log 5 over log 9 which implies here yeah, also 9 can be written as 3 times 3 that's 3 square then what we have here becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 3 squared plus log 5 over log 3 squared, which implies a. We apply the power of log ring. 2 comes here and also here. And we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 over 2 log 3 plus log 5 over 2 log 3. That is. Next step here, this can be written as x equals to 1 plus. Here we have 1 over 2 times log 2 over log 3 plus also 1 over 2 times log 5 over log 3. Then, next step here, we apply change of base. When we have log a over log b. 
this is the same thing as log a to base b. That is, what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus 1 over 2 times log 2 base 3 plus 1 over 2 times log 5 base 3. Then we can bring this together as one fraction. This is 1 over 1. And we have x equals to the SCM here as 2. This becomes 2 then plus. Here we have log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3. That is the value of x here we have 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute. The value of x here, which is x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Then what we have here becomes 9 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 is it equals to 90 on this side then here we have 9 can be written as 3 square which is raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 then is equals to 90 from here. Then this power multiplies and two here cancelled each other. We have 3 raised to the power 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 left. Is equals to 90 on this side. Then this follows and we have a raised to the power n plus n. It's same thing as a raised to the power n times a raised to the power n. That is here, and write this as 3 squared times 3 raised to the power log 2 base 3 times 3 raised to the power log 5 base 3. This is equal to 90 on this side. Then here, 3 squared plus 3 times 3 equals 9 times. Here follows when we have a raised to the power log b to base a, which is equal to b. That is the same thing as 2 and times. Here we have 5. Is it equals to 90 from here? Then 9 times 2, we have 18. 18 times 5 gives us 90. It is equals to 90 from here. That is, left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos. Turn the notification bell. Share this video with a thumbs up and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.